looking through. Just give us a quick update on the interbank market today. Yeah, good afternoon. <laughs> the market today was pretty active in view of uh, inflows from oil majors. Certain inflows came in and that led to appreciation of the Naira by over 40, um, almost 40 kobo. at about a quarter of a percentage point. Um, again, the central bank at the auction today met uh, the demand of 243 million as against the backdrop of $250 million. So all of this contributed to the gain of the Naira by almost 40 kobo. All right, let's talk about the outlook for Forex in Nigeria. You referred to the oil majors, and they've had a torrid time. Collins, we've seen the oil price quite volatile in the last year. It's improving at the moment, but output because of conflict in the Delta has been low in Nigeria, and that's affected how much money comes into the uh, state coffers uh, through the oil trade. What's the outlook for Forex going forward? Sorry, can you take that again, please? Just talk to us about the uh, forecasts for foreign exchange in 2010, given the volatility of the oil price and low output within the oil sector. Well, my view of that is um, I do not see the current uh, appreciation of the Naira at the official market being sustained because uh, the the price is that, sorry, the volume accruing to the reserves in the net effect is dropping. If you look at uh, what the reserve was at the beginning of the year, it was roughly uh, $42 billion, and that has dropped by about 10% to $38 billion as of last week. So I don't see why the federal or strategy, the central bank, would sustain the current appreciation of the Naira that they've been doing for the past uh, four auctions. All right. about what, 29 couple so far. All right, I thank you very much for your time, Collins Akinahimhen.